Ezra chapter 8, these are the heads of their father's houses, and this is the genealogy of those who went up with me from Babylon in the region of King Artaxerxes, of the sons of Phinehas, Gershon, of the sons of Ithamar, Daniel, of the sons of David, Hattush, of the sons of Shechaniah, of the sons of Parosh, Zechariah, and registered with him were 150 males, of the sons of Pehath Moab, Elioni, the son of Zarahiah, and with him 200 males, of the sons of Shechaniah, Ben Jehaziel, and with him 300 males, of the sons of Aden, Ebed, the son of Jonathan, and with him 50 males, of the sons of Elam, Jeshiah, the son of Athaliah, and with him 70 males, of the sons of Shephatiah, Zebediah, the son of Michael, and with him 80 males, of the sons of Joab, Obadiah, the son of Jehiel, and with him 218 males, of the sons of Shalometh, Ben Josephia, and with him 160 males, of the sons of Bebai, Zechariah, the son of Bebai, and with him 28 males, of the sons of Asgad, Johanan, the son of Hakatan, and with him 110 males, of the last sons of Adonikam, whose names are these, Alephalet, Jael, and Shemaiah, and with him 60 males, also of the sons of Bigvi, Uthai, and Zabud, and with them 70 males. Now I gathered them by the river that flows to Ahava, and we camped there three days, and I looked among the people and the priests, and found none of the sons of Levi there. Then I sent for Eleazar, Ariel, Shemaiah, Elnathan, Jareb, Elnathan, Nathan, Zechariah, and Meshulam, leaders, also for Joireb and Elnathan, men of understanding, and I gave them a command for Ido, the chief man, at the place Casaphia, and I told them what they should say to Ido and his brethren, the Nethanim, at the place Casaphia, that they should bring us servants for the house of our God. Then, by the good hand of our God upon us, they brought us a man of understanding of the sons of Malai, the son of Levi, the son of Israel, namely Sherebiah, and with his sons and his brothers, 18 men, and Hashabiah, and with him, Yeshiah, of the sons of Merari, his brothers, and their sons, 20 men, also of the Nethanim, whom David and the leaders had appointed for the service of the Levites, 220 Nethanim, all of them were designated by name. Then I proclaimed a fast there at the river of Ahava, that we might humble ourselves before our God to seek from him the right way for us and our little ones and all our possessions. For I was ashamed to request of the king an escort of soldiers and horsemen to help us against the enemy on the road, because we had spoken to the king, saying, The hand of our God is upon all those for good who seek him, but his power and his wrath are against all those who forsake him. So we fasted and entreated our God for this, and he answered our prayer. And I separated twelve of the leaders of the priests, Sherebiah, Hashabiah, and ten of their brethren with them, and weighed out to them the silver, the gold, and the articles, the offering for the house of our God, which the king and his counselors and his princes and all Israel who were present had offered. I weighed into the hand 650 talents of silver, silver articles weighing 100 talents, 100 talents of gold, 20 gold basins worth a thousand drachmas, and two vessels of fine polished bronze, precious as gold. And I said to them, you are holy to the Lord, the articles are holy also, and the silver and the gold are a freewill offering to the Lord God of your fathers. Watch and keep them until you weigh them before the leaders of the priests and Levites and heads of the fathers' houses of Israel and Jerusalem and the chambers of the house of the Lord. So the priests and the Levites received the silver and the gold and the articles by weight to bring them to Jerusalem, to the house of our God. Then we departed from the river Ahava on the 12th day of the first month to go to Jerusalem. And the hand of our God was upon us and he delivered us from the hand of the enemy and from ambush along the road. So we came to Jerusalem and stayed there three days. Now on the fourth day, the silver and the gold and the articles were weighed in the house of our God by the hand of Merimoth, the son of Uriah, the priest. And with him was Eleazar, the son of Phinehas. With them were the Levites, Josabad, the son of Yeshua, and Odiah, the son of Binui. With the number and weight of everything, all the weight was written down at that time. The children of those who had been carried away captive, who had come from the captivity, offered burnt offerings to the God of Israel, 12 bulls for all Israel, 96 rams, 77 lambs, and 12 male goats as a sin offering. All this was a burnt offering to the Lord, and they delivered the king's orders to the king's satraps and the governors in the region beyond the river. So they gave support to the people and the house of God.